Hi guys, it's me Swastik and this is part 4 of how to make an economy bot and in this video we'll be talking about how to make a cell command and a leaderboard command and with the leaderboard command you'll be able to see the richest people in your server. So let's start. So I already have written all the code and if you want the code you can go to my server and inside of uh, the channel code you can find all the code for the videos. So I'll be just explaining the commands right now. So in the cell command it's similar. I have open account then the result is just a helper function with sell this and the author the item the amount and this is unnecessary actually I'll be explaining this so just this much now if not res so these are the error codes like we discussed in the last video I'll be just explaining the cell this helper function first so the parameters are the user the item name the amount and the price so we actually take in the price and actually it's none so we calculate it right now but if we want we can use this in a use command and set the price to zero so it will actually use these amount like use the amount of items and just you will not get anything from it but it will be used that means the amount will be reduced from the bag but you will not get anything if you pass zero in so i'll be explaining that as well item name is just the lowered version of it the name will be none this is again similar to the buy this function and for each item in main shop we're just checking if um, the item is there in the shop if the item is not in the shop then it will not be in the bag as well then if it's not there we just return false and one which is similar to uh, this one here saying the object isn't there then we will calculate the price now the only difference is inside of this i'm checking if the price is none then the price is going to be the items price otherwise it's zero then we go down calculate the cost and actually the uh, earnings kind of you can say that then the users is um, get bank data then the balance is the we get the balance if we don't need this actually you can re remove this we then try now yeah, this is inside of a try block because if they don't have a bag then it will go to accept and it will return false and three three means that they don't have a bag actually but it just means that you don't have the item in your bag and we just it's again similar to the buy command so we just go through the bag have the index the t is just a tracker that checks um if it's none then that means the object wasn't found and again it returns false and three which means that the item isn't in the bag then we go through every item in the bag and the name we check the name so if it is same that means we found the item we will just check uh, the old amount the new amount is the old amount minus the amount that has been passed in so if this is less than zero that means let's say the the user had five um, watches and he says sell five uh, six watches so this will be minus one and it will be less than zero that means he cannot actually sell these money wa uh, watches so it's going to return false and two as our error code which says you don't have like six watches in your bag so this is it then if it actually uh, worked that means it was zero or greater than zero then it just sets the new amount to the amount then t is set to one as a tracker and then we break and this is just the index updating every time we run through the loop so then we just save this and then we give them the money uh, the cost actually but it's the earnings so they gain um, that much money so which is price times the amount and if it was zero that means we were using the item so for example you used a watch i don't know how you'd use it but i guess you could use it and just set the price that means instead of sell this just set the price to zero that means they won't get anything from this and the amount of items and if you let's say just had one that means you'd use one watch like this so this would be like watch so one watch would be used and they would get nothing so this is it let's just go back now the leaderboard command if i go down so in the leaderboard command i just have the alias as lb now ctx and then x equal to three x is the amount of um, people that we want to show so if it were 10, I guess the top 10 richest people. And if it was one, then top one. And then we just simply say users is the uh, users is get bank data. Then the leaderboard is a dictionary. 
and the total is a list of all the values so for each user in the users the name actually the id is the integer version of the user this will be their id so name will be the place that's storing the id so if you just check the main bank as you can see this will be the name so the integer version so the id exactly this now the amount is their wallet amount plus their bank account a uh, bank amount if i just read this so this is decided on the basis of raw money in the bank and wallet you can check if you, you could just sort by i guess just the wallet amount and so i'm just adding the total amount and this is the total amount then the leaderboard total amount equal to name so this is how it's stored as so let's say they had 500 coins and then their id so like this it'll be stored now id is cannot be used as it's a keyword so we'll be using like id underscore for this later on so then we will append also we'll append this to total okay because we'll be going through total and we'll be accessing that uh, through the leaderboard so the total is we'll then sort it okay so sorting it uh, sorted is a function that uh, makes a list in ascending order that means from the lowest amount of money to the highest amount of money but we don't want this actually we want the highest the richest people to be the first so that's why we reverse it so reverse is true if it will false means if you set it to false then you'll get the poorest people now embed we'll make an embed with title being top x which is people the description is just this and i have a color custom color so if you just want you could add custom discord or color dot red i'll have this color this is a hex code now the index is one the for amount in total so for each amount the id underscore will be the leaderboard so we're accessing the leaderboard so we get their id then we get the member which is client dot get user and we pass in the id so this gives us the uh, member object so i should just call it member so the name will be the member dot name so we'll add a field which is uh, the name is going to be index dot name uh, and the value is the amount and i'll just show this to as well how it looks so if index is x then we break that means um since we adding since we are adding index every time it runs we'll be checking so let's say top five right so we want to break when it's five so if it were let's say just one right so one was passed in as default so it's gonna run through once then instantly it's gonna see that one index is one so x is also one index is also one it'll break out so you'll just get one value if it was two then it would be um it would run through this check that it's not actually x index was uh, x was two this was one it would skip through this go to else add one to index then it'll run through it once more and then it'll break out so this just makes it that we get this x amount of people displayed and then we just send the embed so this is for the code and i'll just show the uh, show the output to you guys so let's check if it works so let's check our balance first i have 105 coins and if i check my bag i have three watches so let's try to sell this let me try to sell one watch and as you can see oh actually it's e sell watch one and i sold this watch let's check my balance if i get the money back as you can see i have 200 coins if you want you could actually reduce it and do something like 70 percent of the amount original amount so instead like in the code you could change this to the price you could have something like 0 0.5 50 percent of the original amount it's your choice i'm gonna keep it like something like i think 90 percent is fine so something like 0 0.9 times the item and um let's check let's try to sell something that isn't there so sell lol and it doesn't work and if i try to sell something like 100 um actually sell 100 watches and as you can see we don't have 100 watches in our bag and let's check the leaderboard to finish this e leaderboard lb as you can see top one richest people and 
if I do something like LB3 as you can see we get it and LB2 as well so that's it for today guys I hope you enjoyed if you did hit the like button and subscribe and also join the discord server and I'll meet you in the next one goodbye